but one of the only issues that I have with my new car is that I don't have like a little slot to put my hand out, like because in my old car it was like a trademark. So I think I have to like cut a hole or something from that one because like I nearly bust the window that time. Like. My name is Connor Shanahan. I'm 15, and this is my professional drift car. Drifting is my life, and I want to prove to myself that I can come on top this season, beating the strongest drivers in the European Superstar Series. But it's not going to be easy. One of my strongest rivals is my brother Jack. Yeah, your older and more talented brother. <laughs> Together we're going to take you behind the scenes of our journey and expose the highs and lows while travelling as a family throughout Europe. And of course, have some fun along the way. It has taken a lot of family effort to get where we are today. Our family has put everything on the line. And we are not stopping here. History is the making. You're watching The Shanahan's. And we are now getting on plane. All right, Jack. You do. You do. Where's the jet? So just after private jet, trying to meet Frank and Flo. Go to Flo's workshop and see what he's done to the cars and load them up. Back to Poland tonight. <laughs> <laughs> you fit the all of us? Uh, no. I think me and John will fit in here. This one's fit. Fuck it. <laughs> hey. Hey man, how are you doing? Fuck traffic. What's <laughs> up? Massive car, you've loaded up. What do you like being this close to you, Gareth? It's pretty cool. Hey, 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 come on! Oh. Get out of the way! 20 minutes later. We are in the Netherlands. <laughs> Tell us that, what. That's drift heaven. <laughs> So you gotta tell people what these are. That is actually a drift car. Looks like a pretty shit drift car. <laughs> yeah, well, I don't think you're allowed to run these kind of tires anywhere. Or oh, wheels as ugly as this, so it's fair. <laughs> <laughs> so it's an A86, but like it's oh, drag it's car. This is cool. Mercedes 190E. What is it like? A Paul. You know, like the June buggies built on the Volkswagen Beetle chassis? Yeah. Uh, Apple was a manufacturer of these bodies. Oh, okay. So they made toilets of this one, and there are only 150 made. Oh, really? Yeah. Gee, it's like a history lesson. Oh, yeah. Alpha, Matana, GTA. It's cool, the body kit in this is nice. How low this car is. Like, it's uh, making like 130 horsepower, original mini engine. Yeah? Yeah. Sure. Uh, dog box, straight cut. So uh, the, these things are uh, like uh, fun to drive because they weigh like, I think, somewhere around 580 kilograms. It's so small. Jeez. <laughs> really love this 190E. I think that the, the boxiness is like, Basically, when you order parts from Mercedes, you get a blue box with the diagonal lines. Oh. So this is basically a parts box. <laughs> it, was an, it was an actual library on, on, uh, it was on the Evo 2 though, and this is an Evo 1. So, I don't that one. <laughs> and this one? Oh, uh, that's a piece of shit American car, which is probably it's right. huge, yeah. Oh yeah, but they all are. It's massive. This thing is not front wheel drive, is it? It is. What a waste of time. Yeah. Oh. Is that no 
Hey Frank, so John reckons, oh lordy lord. We've been in Van Lowe about three weeks and we're after travelling about eight hours. So we're going well. <laughs> yeah, we're all sick of driving now to be honest. We thought to go for a little detour there off of the motorway because there was roadworks and they were laying us like yeah. another hour and 45 minutes. John, keep over there, small of us. Oh. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh. Get back. Hold on. Happy. Right. Before that, we kicks off the touch now. <laughs> Driving is absolutely horrendous. Not for speeding, oh Jesus. Hey, motherfucker. Tomorrow. So everything's ready to rock. Jack's jumping in the car. Ready, Jack? You what? You? Excited? Yeah, look forward to it. So we're in the queue, ready to rock for practice, getting strapped in. Jack is over there next to me. He's about to do his run first. Super, super excited for this event. It was my best event last year, so hopefully we can carry it on this year. Can't wait to get out there now and do a lap and uh, see how we get on. So let's get my stuff on and uh, in for the track. <laughs> more but I think we're only going to get two more before qualifying so there's our jacked up getting some work done a boost bike came off of my car on my second run and found a bit of an oil leak but they're getting it sorted now changing some things on the setup of Jack's car but uh yeah really really happy excited yeah we're off putting marks in the car we don't need to have fun for I hit the wall look at the back so more holes thank god you don't drive a bigger car I didn't need to figure out where the back of the car was, so I just said I'd do it effective. So yeah, really, really excited now for modifying. Oh, <laughs> they were sick. sport period but 
Yeah, it's a big ask to come back and do that again. It certainly is, Dave. And you know what? Just taking a look at this run, this looks like it's absolutely phenomenal at the moment. That's a little bit of impact from Shanahan, but the, 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 the speed and the, and the technique, and look at that, hardly any deacceleration there as he gets nice and close to that wall and across the line. That, Dave, is a very, very good run from Connor Shanahan. And look at that fist pumps inside the car. He's ecstatic with that. Technically, that for me was incredible. Let's see as we move it along to our next driver. It's Jack Shanahan. He's currently sitting in third position at the Driftmasters European Championship. All top three drivers at the moment. Irish drivers winning. I know he's not going to go 5%. He's going to go 150%. And look at this, Dave, off the line already. Shanahan bringing the heat. Unbelievable initiation from Shanahan. Can he keep on that line, though? Can he stay inside that zone? He certainly can. What a silly question. As Shanahan now puts foot to floor. Look at the transition. Look at the speed he carries hardly any use of the handbrake. Like big angle. He's going to put the front bumper on the wall again. Look at this from Jack Shanahan as he looks to top qualifying. He knows James Dean's up there and he wants that crown, Dave. Well, right now he's done nothing wrong. This is perfection so far from Shanahan. He hasn't hit anything and he's been as close as anybody else has been all day. He's got to go through that little bit of a sticky substance on the ground and let's see how he negotiates that, which is fine. Can he finish strong? It's a big run so far. He has a 95 on the board. He's got to touch a wall here. He's going to do something crazy over the line. He's going for it. On the edge of the track. Holds it all the way across. So if that's not as good as it gets, I don't know what is. And, and maybe, maybe that's almost matching what he's done before, but it may just creep up. I, I don't know. It's too, too narrow a margin at this point at the top. But I have never watched Jack Shining go out there and dominate a track. Last year, his brother came here and showed the whole world what he was doing. That was fucking good. Watch again, oh, 98. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. Man, you can't see anything. Oh, it's dead. The sun is really coming back <laughs> around here and then saying. Oh, man, I've never had no sun in the car. Awesome, congrats. Oh, thank you. Awesome. Great job. Oh, fuck. So, James, just in his second run, he got a 97, which is pretty sick. So. I'm still top with a 98, Dwayne is doing his run right now, so not too sure what the story is, but man, what a buzz, holy shit.